Hey YouTube! So, it's me Jess. Um, I haven't done a vlog in a little while, and I don't know how much of this I'm actually going to vlog, but one of my goals this year is, um, one, to go to as many concerts as I possibly can, and two is, um, to get more involved in the local scene, um, and so, um, I found an artist, um, so, I actually found the opening act first, um, his name is Alex DeLeo, and I found him because he followed me on Instagram, which, um, he since unfollowed me, which is, like, not cool, but it's fine, um, and then I found out that he was coming to a show here in Tampa, and he's actually opening for an artist named Max Frost, and so I looked both of them up, um, they seem pretty cool, and they seem really talented, so, um, I think it should be a good show, and, um, uh, there's no, like, official, like, meet and greet kind of thing, but from what I've seen from pictures that he's tagged in, he seems to go and meet fans around after the show anyway, so hopefully maybe I can meet him, and I'm just hoping for a fun night of live music, and I'm going to try and vlog some of it for you, so thank you for watching. I just parked, and thank goodness my school has a parking garage over here, so I got parking for free, so that was great. Now I am... Trying to find the venue, and hopefully I get there in enough time to get a good view. So I'm excited. You are, we will separate in the skies are turning gray, but tonight, come as you are, stay the little later. There's something to weigh in tonight. Tell me about you every day and all the things that you don't like. I'll make them right. We can have a drink and talk about the places we might find We'll start tonight Come on, won't you kiss me on the Brooklyn Bridge? We don't got the money to come to the Bridge We got something we can go tonight and there Now I know She's sitting next to me So I can see you rising like the fireworks on the 4th of July Sit next to me, we can start a fire, watch it burn, watch it burn so bad. Tell me about your appetite and all the things that you don't like, I'll make them right. We can have a drink and talk about the places we might find, we'll start tonight. In your heart, the reason you should never part. Take what you see it'll set you free cause I just wanna be in love and only with you and I know you know I you and I so baby come my way as the road strips down and the night gets cold we hold my hand and pray Cause I know it's on a will we And I will see a reason I will see why we would let this go
thinking that now I'm gonna escape this fucked up feeling. I got on a flight, economy glass. I'm gonna sleep, I listen to jazz. I never know if I'm staring at something on a phone screen. Feeling a little bit, hoping that you call me. To my surprise, but I guess that I was wrong. And I was getting Thank you. 
After the concert has ended, and I'm sorry the lighting is really horrible, but it's like 11 o'clock at night and I'm in a parking garage in my car, so I can't really do much about the lighting, but I wanted to um, kind of end this vlog and I wanted to talk about my experience at the concert, so um, that was amazing. Um, so the concert, I think I said before, it was, um, his name is Max Frost, and then the opener was Alex DeLeo. Um, Alex, I think I said that wrong. I think it's Alex DeLeo. I'm sorry if I pronounced that wrong the first time. So a really weird thing happened. Um, so like I said in my last video, um, I'm going to be transferring to UCF and I'm going to be majoring in entertainment management and I'm going to be trying to go for my dream job of working in the music industry. So just this past week, um, I found my roommates, well a couple of roommates, we still need one more. Um, and one of them, her name is Amanda, and I saw her profile on, um, on the roommate matching thing, and, uh, I was like, we would be f perfect roommates, because she's also an entertainment management major, and she wants to be work in the music industry like me, and she's a big music fan and concert goer. Um, we have a little bit of different music tastes, but we ha also have some similar interests, so I was like, okay, we would be perfect roommates, and so, um, we ended up getting a room together. Um, we like literally like just picked our room this week and everything. And then I go to the show and then I'm posting on my Instagram story about it and then I watch her Instagram story and she was posting about it and said that she was ready for Max Frost is what she put on her thing. And so I messaged her and I was like, OMG, are you here at the show too? And she was like, yeah, I am. And um, 
then, then I found her and then I met her and um, she's really cool and she's really nice. Um, it was um, it was an interesting way that we met each other because we both were like we thought that we were going to have a couple of months before we actually met each other and we were kind of unprepared of what we were going to say. Um, it, was, it was slightly awkward, so Amanda, if you're watching this, hi. I'm sorry if I was awkward, but it was really nice to meet you, um, and I can't wait to be roommates with you. Um, so yeah, that was really cool, and it was one of those like weird things where it was like, it was that was not a coincidence whatsoever. That was meant to be, and it when that happened, it was like, I just felt like it was one of those things where it was telling me that I made the right decision to follow my dream and um, that like, I don't know, like just that whole weird coincidence just told me like, this is where you're meant to be. And this was not like, this was supposed to happen and you're supposed to follow your dream sort of thing. So that was just one of those weird life moments that like, I just love when those kinds of things happen. So yeah, so that was fun. Um, and then the show started and oh my god, Max Frost is amazingly talented. Like, um, I just found him recently and I didn't know too much about him. Um, I looked up some of his songs on YouTube and Spotify and watched some performances. And I knew that I was going to like his style of music and I knew that he was going to be really talented and good. But I did not realize how amazingly talented he was going to be. Like, he can sing, he can play guitar, he can play piano. And he can play the drums, like, oh my goodness, he's so talented, and he's so energetic, and I've been to a lot of concerts, but his concert was, like, one of the most unique performances that I've ever seen. It's very creative, um, it's very high energy, it gets you going. Um, he has a lot of great songs, too, which you saw earlier in the clips, um, and he's just, he just seems like a really nice guy. Um, I didn't get to meet him because I found out after the show that for the show they were doing, like, they did a pre-sale, like, meet and greet, um, sale, I guess. They were selling tickets before, um, which I didn't know about the show until, like, a couple weeks ago, so I didn't get in on the pre-sale meet and greet or whatever, because if I knew about that, I would have bought them, but oh well. Um, but after the show, um, I did get to meet Alex, which was cool. Um, he's the whole reason that I found out about the show, um, <clears throat> because of, he, like, so he followed me on Instagram, and then, um, like I said earlier, like, he, like, unfollowed me or whatever, but I found out about the show and about Max Frost because of him, so I definitely wanted to meet him. Um, I didn't talk about his performance yet. He was amazing as well, um very talented and I would love to see well I would love to see both of them again but um but yeah so Alex was really good too he was also really sweet um I went up to I went up to him and uh he introduced himself said hi um I introduced myself um and then I bought an album I bought an album from both him and Max Frost just because I'm a big music supporter and I especially am a big supporter of physical CDs over um, streaming, so I wanted to make sure to support them and buy their album, and, um, and yeah, he was really sweet, um, we took the picture, it came out good, I'll probably put it at the end here, and, um, he's, he's, local, he's from Florida, but he moved to, I think he said he moved to Nashville, so, um, I would like to see him a bit, I would like to see him again if he comes here and does a show again, and I would love to see Max again. Um, there were a lot of moments tonight where I was like, uh, this always happens at concerts, but there was a lot of moments tonight where I was like, I live for nights like this. Like, I was so happy at the concert, and I'm really happy that I went. Um, <clears throat> I also want to talk about, like, some of my favorite songs that Max did. So, I think my favorites were... Um, I think Money Problems was probably my favorite performance of the night. I got a really good video of that, which you probably saw before this. And then, um, I also really liked, um, Sometimes was a really good song, and so was, um, Anxious. Um, I, the reason I know the names is because I listened, the first, well, so I listened to some of the other songs before I came, but I didn't listen to the album in full until I was, like, on my way here, um, which I know is kind of bad of me, but oops. 
Um, I'm probably going to listen to it on the way back home, too, and tonight was just an amazing night, and it's, it's again, it's nights like these where I'm like, this is where I want to be every night. Uh, I want to be working in this industry, and I want to be helping people in this industry, and every time I go to a concert, it's just a reminder of that, and tonight was especially, like, you're meant to be here, you're um, meant to do this, and so I had a great night, and I'm sorry this last clip was so long, it's just, I'm feeling passionate, clearly, and it, I just want to talk about the concert and how amazing it was, so thank you for watching this, and I'll see you later, bye. Um, I forgot one last thing before I end the vlog totally. Um, I wanted to show you the, the albums that I bought. Um, so this album is uh, Max's album. It's called Gold Rush. Um, if you've never heard of Max before, you should definitely listen to him. Um, or like even honestly watch a live performance because he's really amazing live. And um, his songs are really good. So yeah, you should definitely check out his album. And then Alex, I bought his album. I think it's technically, yeah, I think it's an EP technically. Um, the cover is really pretty. And then he actually, the CD is really pretty too. Um, yeah, it's really pretty. Um, and then he signed it for me. And then he, sa he said, nice meeting you, Jess, which was cute. So yes, those were the albums that I got. And then um, Alex was giving away these free stickers. So that was nice of him. And yeah, that was everything that I bought, um, cause like I said, I just really wanted to support them, and, um, I forgot to add that in earlier, but I think now I'm going to officially end the vlog, and head home, and try to go to sleep, even though I'm really hyper, because the show was amazing, but... Yeah, I'm sorry this was like very ranty and rambly, I'm just fangirling, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this vlog, and thank you for watching, bye!